First at 11, two teens shot. One is fighting for his life, and one or more shooters are on the loose tonight. WCPO 9 News reporter Sean Delancey is in Kennedy Heights with the latest in the investigation. Sean? Yeah, Craig, police say that those two teens were shot in an apparent drive-by with gunfire coming from a white Chevy Spark with at least four people inside. Police say that they believe that that car was chasing the two teens that were shot. Police say the first calls came in just before 5 o'clock, and when they got to this area between Kirkup and Zinzel Avenues, they found a 16-year-old with life-threatening injuries. He was taken to UC Medical. They also found a 17-year-old with critical injuries. He was taken to Cincinnati Children's Hospital, but he's expected to be okay. Police say right now it's critical to find the shooter or shooters to make the streets safer. So if anybody has information, please call Crime Stoppers so we can get these people off the street and make this place a safer place to live. Captain Dennis Swingley there says that white Chevy Spark is likely to have heavy front end damage, so it should be easily recognizable. Now this is still a developing situation, so stick with us both here on air and over at WCPO.com for the latest. In Kennedy Heights, I'm Sean Delancey, WCPO 9 News.